For language is very powerful. With language, you create. It's not just words. You create an energy. You create a world. Therefore, you have to be so careful with every word that escapes your lips. All your organs are either external or internal. Your hands, external. Your heart, internal, right? But your tongue is the only organ that is both external and internal. It, internal is external and has two gates, your teeth and your lips. You have to close the gates before you use it. If you master that, close the gates, lock them before you speak, think. What you didn't say, you can always say in the future. As a matter of fact, language is so important that God gave us an international expression, international expression in Hebrew, which is the same in every language to prove to us, to remind us that He created the world with words. What is that expression? Is there such an international expression? Same in French, in German, in Hungarian, in Polish, in Spanish, in English, in Hebrew, in every language. It's a Hebrew word. Then a magician gets up to perform his magic. He says, Abracadabra. What does that mean? Abra means I shall create Kadabra as I have spoken. That's Hebrew from Sefer Yetziva, from the Book of Creation. It's Kabbalah. I shall create as I have spoken. It's not gibberish. It's Hebrew. It's the holy tongue. So in a marriage, if you could remember that with your words, you create either goodness or you create negative energies, be careful.